Forget about it. What's up, you two? This is Cooking with Doug. You know, the black guy with over 60 air fryer videos. You still don't know? What are you freaking kidding me? Hey, Beck, keep it down over there. I'm trying to talk to the YouTubers out there. You know what I'm saying? Anyway. What, what do I usually say? Uh, today I'm going to make some air fryer strambolis. Yeah, we're going to make it Doug style though. <laughs> well anyway, enough of that. Um, I want to show you what I got. Uh, I got some honey, I guess honey glazed ham, some sharp cheddar cheese, some turkey, um, what is that, um, oven roasted, we got some baby spinach, of course we got, we can't, we, we need that, and I got some provolone, I was going to put some mushrooms in there, oh, and I don't have pepperoni, I'm sorry guys, I thought I had some in my refrigerator, but I did not, and I just came from Walmart, and I could have picked up some, but I didn't, but that's okay. Um, I figured I need to cut something out. I don't want to die while I eat this sandwich. Anyway. Um, yeah, so this is the pizza crust that I'm going to use. So let me go ahead and pop the top. Forget about it. And guys, this is the first time I'm making this. Um, a lot of people, and shout out to my kitchen uh, gadgets group, first of all, on Facebook. But on my other Facebook group, uh, my Cook Essentials Air Fryer group, a lot of people have been making strambolis and um, I promised myself I'd try. I've never made it before, so this is my first time doing it. I actually took this much off. I don't want to make that much, and so I'm just trying to thin it out as best I can. And, yeah. Alright, guys, that's about as thin as I want it. It looks good to me. All right, cool. So the first thing I'm gonna do is sprinkle this uh, complete seasoning on it. You could do Italian seasoning if you have it. I'm just gonna sprinkle this on there. Some great flavor. I'm gonna start with some sharp cheese. Now I don't want to be any, uh, too close to the edge. I like that. All right, I added two pieces of uh, turkey, oven roasted, by the way. I'm gonna add uh, two slices of mozzarella cheese. All right, I'm gonna add some salami. Yeah, ugh. Not too, not too crazy about salami, but it's all right. Gonna add some honey ham. Alright, added my baby spinach. I'm gonna add the same seasoning that I added to the dough to that just a little bit. And finally some provolone. Alright. Alright, I rolled it. Now I'll be honest with you guys, I borrowed some dough to get the sides because I didn't have enough dough for that. So, that's what it's looking like. See? Oh, and I gotta actually fix that up. I want to show you. We don't care. You know how we do. You make it do what it do. Alright, so let me fix that up. And then I'm gonna um, put some olive oil, brush some olive oil on, on um, both sides. Then we'll be ready for the air fryer, basically. Wait, 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 you thought I wasn't going to do this? 
What, you kidding me? Alright guys, so I'm just going to put some light olive oil on both sides. And also what I'm going to do, just to show you, I'm also going to sprinkle some garlic powder on it. So it'll be extra yummy. Alright, this is what we're looking like. Now we're ready for the air fryer. I'm going to go ahead and do 370 for uh, 15 minutes. No, actually, I'm going to do 10 minutes. And then I'm going to flip and do another 10 minutes when that's done. All right, this is with um, two minutes left, so it was eight minutes. So I would suggest you do it seven minutes aside. Ten minutes is too long, at least for my Cook Essentials uh, 5.3 quart. So um, yeah, let's go ahead and flip it, and we'll do it for another seven minutes. Ah, you like that? Look what my air fryer rag did. <laughs> That's pimp like. Look at this over here. Are you kidding me? This looks really, 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 really good, guys. And um, I'm just going to tell you, if you, you don't have to put garlic powder on it, but if you do, just know it's going to brown faster than if you didn't. But I definitely recommend 377 minutes each side, for sure. So let's take it out and plate it. Look at this, guys. Pretty awesome for my first try. That's the bottom. But I like that garlic crust feel. Feels like, like pizza crust, sort of. I like that. Mmm. I smell it. You smell it? Smell it. Mmm. Alright, let's cut into it. I'm just going to go ahead and cut it in half and see what we're looking like. Not the best cutter at all, but... That's what we're looking like. Not bad. I can dig it. Smell it. Now take a bite. Alright guys, as always, you know I gotta take a bite. Man, this thing is packed solid. Look at that crust, y'all. Mm. Like you don't even eat it. Like you make love to these sandwiches. You know what I mean? Anyway, let me take a bite. Mmm. Mmm. Oh yeah. This is good. You see all that? Mm. Well, anyway, guys, I need to wrap this up. But before I do that, you know, I got to give a big, big, big shout out to uh, Janice in my air fryer group on Facebook because I kind of stole her. I jacked her recipe. Did a couple tweaks. I didn't make it exactly like her as good as you know. I do my own thing. But shout out to Janice because... Um, and, and the other people, the other like 10 people that made uh, the Stromboli because that inspired me to do it. You guys have inspired me because I've never, in fact, I've never eaten one. I've never made one. This is my first time making it and see, I did it.
And how how did I do it? From watching you guys, watching the pics um, in my Facebook group, and some of the tips and tricks that you've uh, that you guys have put there. So big ups to y'all. And I did this. I want to do this video to my YouTube subscribers who are not on my Facebook page because we leave no child behind. But anyway, hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe, and also I'll leave the link to my air fryer group in the um, in the description so you guys can join if. You're not scared to use your air fry. If you're scared to use your air fry, get out of my group. Don't don't come in my group. We don't want no cornballs in there. Anyway, we out.